Switching gears, we're learning new details tonight about the discovery of a local teen who went missing two weeks ago. Wilmington police say the body of Miona Jones was found this morning. WAY Celeste Smith joins us live in the newsroom with more. Celeste. While Hannah and Jeff, Wilmington Police Chief Donnie Williams and New Hanover County District Attorney Ben David say that there are still su two suspects identified in the case of Myona Jones. Miona Jones' half-brother, Jarice Jones, has been in custody since November 2nd. His girlfriend, Randy Johnson, was charged with obstruction of justice on November 5th and are expected to possibly face additional charges. We do anticipate uh, murder charges coming out. Uh, but we are going to be deliberate and make sure that we have uh, the necessary forensic evaluations that need to take place. Chief Williams says police searched the new Hanover County landfill for Miona Jones for the last two weeks. This is an active ongoing investigation and we're doing everything in our power to ensure that anyone involved, they're charged to the fullest extent with the commission of this despicable crime. They were assisted by multiple agencies, including New Hanover County Sheriff's Office, FBI, Brunswick Search and Rescue, Pender County Sheriff's Office, Wilmington Fire, and Q Center for Missing Persons. I have never seen um, a more extensive investigation to try and bring a child home than what I've been personally witnessing over these last two weeks. This is not the homecoming any of us wanted, uh, but I applaud all of those agencies. We want to send our condolences to her family, her friends during this extremely difficult time. We're asking the community to keep them uplifted in prayer. Although the landfill was the center of the search initially, District Attorney Ben David did not share what led investigators to Pender County, where Miona's body was found. Her 17th birthday would have been last Friday. 